What's going on guys, I'm Mikado and welcome back to another Unreal Engine for Fortnite tutorial. Today I'll be showing you how to make roads using splines. So if you don't know what splines are, if you actually go on to the landscape mode and click manage, we'll see here that there are splines. But it's actually really easy to use. I learned it less than 5 minutes, day it came out. It doesn't take long at all. Let's get started. So again, go on to landscape mode, go to manage and click on splines. Before you do that, make sure you get your terrain not like this <laughs> let's just flatten it here real quick let's just do some flattening remove that giant terrain we actually will keep this too we're actually gonna build a road up there that's a little better so let's go to manage click on splines and hold control and click where you want the beginning of your road to start so i'm gonna like start it right there and then this creates a spline right here and then you can actually hold control again create another one and then what you're gonna do is go down here to your content browser and then search up road one. And then you're gonna see road straight here. We're gonna keep that there. So what we're gonna do is go on to the left here and click on segments. Once you click on segments, go down until you see spline meshes and click this little plus sign here. And then you'll see this little drop down thing here right beside index, click on that. And then we'll see a mesh option. Take this road straight and simply drop it onto there. Would you look at that, we got a road right here. So I'm gonna make the road start here and kind of make it go up there, up onto that little hill right there. So what I'm gonna do is click on this little, you'll see it here, a little mountain looking icon there. Click on that, make sure it's gold, hold control, and then you can keep adding more splines. So I'm gonna make it go right up here. And you notice there, it kind of went inside the ground, not an issue. Go back to manage and click these little mountains, simply lift it up just a little bit so we can get above this little mountain here. And then this part what I'll do is smoothen it a bit, get that out of the way. And then we'll go back to manage, go back to spline, click this one here, hold control, and we're just gonna do this again. We're gonna make it go over here. And then we're gonna pause right there. So if we actually take a look at our road here, you might think it looks good. Until you get down to the edges, this looks kind of ugly. So what we're gonna do is go to paint, make sure we're on the sand layer, and then we're just gonna like paint the edges here so it blends it a bit more. What kind of sucks is that they don't exactly match, which is an unfortunate thing. Just kind of go around on it. Make sure you get underneath the road too, because if we actually if we actually get close to it, you'll see that there is grass growing in the middle of it. So we don't want that. That's kind of ugly. So we're just going to go into paint and just kind of draw all around it, getting the edges. And that looks really bad. Let's just spin that out. Going underneath the road, more, most importantly though too, getting rid of that grass. And then we'll just kind of do the same up here. We're just going to smoothen it out. Boom, look at that, pretty cool. And now for this little road here, you'll see, ew, that's ugly, it is ugly. So what we're gonna do is go to Sculpt, make sure it's on this tool right here, and then we're going to kind of, I know it looks bad right now, do this on purpose, all right? This is kind of what I do. I, I make it kind of go above the road on purpose, and then I'll actually go to Erosion here. It will actually kind of push it down nicely, so it's underneath the road. Let's actually turn down the strength a lot more. What we'll do is kind of just push it underneath the road slightly. And then around the edges, we'll take the sculpting tool and go around it purposely on the edges. Just like that. We'll just keep going back and forth to the sculpting tool and to the erosion tool. Keep going back and forth to them until you get this like kind of blend almost. Where it's kind of touching the road, almost touching the road, you know. Um, so here it's too much on the road. Let's actually go into settings. I like doing this with the foliage off, just me. You can see kind of there, we're pushing it, slowly pushing it off the road. So it's slightly off the road. Again, we're going to push it off with this erosion tool. And then we're going to paint the road now. So boom, boom. Pretty cool, pretty nice. We're going to go underneath of it too. I'm sorry, I'm making it look really weird here. Let's just like smoothing out the edges. I'm adding way too much dirt. I don't think you want to add that much dirt on the edges of them. And then that's that. That's roads. Now what I'm going to do is challenge us and make it go up this mountain. So how you're going to do this is go to sculpt, go to ramp. If you guys missed my last video, I kind of showed you how to use a ramp. I'm going to show you again in this tutorial for this context. And then hold control and tap where you want the ramp to be. We're going to make it ramp all the way up on this mountain. Ramp it right boom right to there we're gonna adjust the width just so it's a little bit bigger i think that's good and then hit enter look at that we got a little ramp going on here and now what we'll do is go back to manage go to our spline click on that one hold control and we're gonna make it go right up this ramp now you know it's an issue here again don't worry click on this we're just gonna lift it up a bit boom easy as that lift this one up a bit and then up here what i'm gonna do is go to my flattening tool again if you missed my last tutorial if you don't know how to use landscape be sure to check that video out we're gonna flatten out this area here just like this so we have our road just kind of go up here i'm just gonna end it up here i'm not gonna make it go any further just for the video but and now what you can try you can try this i don't know if it'll work we'll see you can kind of push it so this is underneath of it it might actually work i actually haven't had any luck with this for my maps but uh yeah we can kind of push it down here 
it's kind of in it. We'll see it's kind of going underground. Then we'll take our tool, do the same thing, and kind of push it off of it. Pretty cool, pretty sweet. Again, you can see it's kind of hovering above the grass. That's why it suggests having foliage off so you can see all this detail. Let's just kind of lower the strength here. And again, just kind of go around it. There's probably, again, there's other ways. There's always other ways of doing everything for anything. But this is just my way of doing this. Kind of what I've learned to do is kind of just go above it here. We're just going to keep doing this here. What you can also do too, I'm kind of doing it here, is make like a little mountain going up above the... Uh, road here so you can kind of you know shorten it here so you can kind of do what you want uh here we go look at that pretty cool and uh yeah that's kind of that this is kind of just like the basic road again we'll take the paint and we'll just that's not paint Ooh. and then we'll take it and smoothen the edges i probably have a lot of dirt i wouldn't do that <laughs> um but that's that pretty cool hope you all enjoyed subscribe like and comment down below be sure to join the, be sure to join the discord in the description down below if you have any questions you can ask there or you can ask in the comments down below and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye bye